in this segment we'll discuss about how to write a VHDL code for full subtractor using structure style of modeling VHDL tutorial series may now for the upcoming videos we'll see how to write combinational circuit codes using data flow behavioral and structural style of modeling so let us start with full as you know full subtractor is a combinational circuit which basically accept three inputs and it produces two outputs namely difference and bore up three inputs are abc hai to do output hai difference of bore or this is the equation for difference and this is for bore now based on the given terminologies we'll switch to check how we can write a bsdl code in that case the very first step we'll start with defining the library element which is library i triple baad mein hum iska use karenge so i written the statement use hame use karna hai i triple so i have written i triple dot standard logic 1164 ye hai ek package and from that we have to use all the functions and components so i have written the statement as dot all baad mein hum declare karenge entity entity the name is going to be full subtractor is then we'll go for defining the port as abc input hai difference or borrow output hai iske baad hum is end karenge now we'll move on to write the code using structural style of modeling so we are writing architecture structure of entity name is full subtractor is then we'll start with declaring the component in this case we need components like xor similarly we need not gate we need and gate and we need or gate that means we have to declare four components starting with xor2 so we have written component xor2 is ab iska hum port declare karenge is basically accept karega two inputs aur produce karega one output baad mein isko hum end bhi karenge end the components se then we'll move on to declaring the component as and2 uske bhi do inputs hai one output hai usko bhi end karenge then we'll declare the component as or2 again two inputs one output then will end the component so let us start with component instantiation that means how we can use the components of friends here you can see we are using xor gate uska ek input a hai aur b now hamare paas three input ka xor gate hota to hum a b c input le sakte the at difference output but we are using using component which accept two inputs therefore i am using a b as input and iska jo result hoga wo store karenge hum s0 mein that is why the first input signal that is required will be s0 similarly a bar ke liye hum s1 use karenge a bar b ka product ke liye hum use karenge s2 a bar c ke liye hum use karenge s3 b c ke liye use karenge s5 aur s2 s3 ka jo addition hai usko liye hum use karenge s4 finally aap dekh sakte hai agar main ek or gate use karta hu ek input s4 hai ek input s5 hai to uska output aa jayega bar so in order to deal with this we are going to declare signals s0 s1 s2 s3 s4 and s5 basically they are the bit ye ho jane ke baad hum likhenge component instantiation in that case first i am going to use here an xor gate with port map a as input b as output and output is going to be s0 so we are written a comma b and output will be s0 now once this statement is executed we'll get s0 is equal to axr b next we'll use x2 that is another component of xor xor2 port map iska ek input aa jayega s0 second hai c in aur s0 c in ka jo xoring hai uska output hai difference so written output as difference now based on these two statements we'll get difference as a xor p xor c ye ho jane ke baad hum jayenge for ke liye अब बोरो रिजल्ट जनरेट करने के लिए हमें सबसे पहले लगेगा ए बार ए बार इज नथिंग बट एज यू नो इट इज गोइंग टू बी ए नॉट गेट्स आउटपुट हुज इनपुट विल बी ए एंड आउटपुट विल बी एस वन सो लेट अस सी दिस वन एज एन वन नॉट वन पोर्ट मैप इनपुट ए है तो आउटपुट आ जाएगा एस वन वेयर एस वन विल बी इक्वल्स टू ए बार सिमिलरली विल यूज एन पोर्ट ए बार पी का प्रोडक्ट जनरेट करने के लिए एन टू पोर्ट मैप एक इनपुट है एस दूसरा है बी तो इसका आउटपुट आ जाएगा S2. S2 becomes equals 